Audi light products are characterized by their modern design and technological innovations. Our customers experience Audi light design through sophisticated safety concepts, as well as high quality materials and finish. But it has been the invention by Nobel laureate in physics, Suji Nakamura, who has revolutionized the use of lighting in the car. When I developed blue LEDs, uh, missing color was uh, blue and green. So uh, I expected if uh, I could invent blue and green LEDs, I could uh, make all, all kinds of uh, colors. Audi Matrix LED headlights are a prime example of our light strategy. They are dynamic, interactive, and three-dimensional. The high beam is divided into individual segments, and a camera identifies the area in which a vehicle is approaching from or driving ahead in. The high beam is then dimmed in precisely that area. Today we have a great many dynamic functions in our cars. First and foremost, dynamic turn signals. The turn signal goes from inside to outside so the direction in which a vehicle is turning can be seen clearly, even when the vehicle is partially obscured. For Audi, design means so much more than just styling. It is the aesthetic expression of the values that characterize the brand. Progressiveness, sportiness, and sophistication. The laser light on the Audi R8 LMX doubles the range of the high beam compared with a conventional LED headlight. That gives us significantly greater safety at night. The laser headlight is intelligent, very intelligent. And development continues. In the coming years, more new, innovative technologies will find their way into series production. In pre-development, we are looking into solutions for arranging and configuring two-dimensional OLEDs in a three-dimensional way. Software will take on great importance. Why not offer light functions as an app? The vision for the year 2030 is a light that is constantly interacting with the people and environment around it. It is a vision with which Audi seeks to remain the leader in light innovation. And design, safety, and connection between man and environment will continue to be crucial in the future.
Here we are in Tromsø, 300 kilometers north of the Arctic Circle, where we have organized a press event. We've invited journalists to test our Matrix LED technology in the Audi A6 so that they can gain first-hand experience in using it. Arctic conditions await the participants. Snow and early darkness will give us an opportunity to test lighting functions intensively under really extreme conditions. It will demonstrate very clearly what this technology can actually do. I have three great dreams here. First, I want to drive the Quattro on snow and ice, of course. Second, I would definitely like to see the Northern Lights. And if that doesn't happen, third, I would at least like to be convinced that Matrix LED lighting also operates very well in the snow. In Matrix LED technology, the high beam headlight is partitioned into various zones that can be controlled on an entirely individual basis. A vehicle camera is used to detect oncoming traffic and traffic ahead of the vehicle. Then those segments that would cause glare to the other road users are deactivated. The benefit to drivers is that they can continue to drive with the high beam lights active the entire time, and they do not have to worry about adjusting them. The driver gets better illumination and, of course, greater convenience and safety as well. I can honestly say I was really scared during the first meters that I drove on snowy roads in Norway, but as I gradually got into a groove I had a lot of fun. That's because I noticed that the Quattro principle does a great job here too, with the spikes, and it's a lot of fun. Auch noch dazu hier hervorragend aufgeht und man hat da schon eine Menge Spaß. At the home of Quattro, we immediately think of snow-covered streets and winter conditions, and that's exactly what we have up here, north of the Arctic Circle. Mal sehr, sehr deutlich. I've already driven Audis that have matrix lighting, and I've always been very impressed with everything it can do. Going fast here in the far north, the system operates excellently, and it gives an edge when it comes to lighting, because you really can see further. 
I'm very satisfied. Every day we had polar lighting conditions. The journalists were enthused and the results far exceeded even our expectations. I can just say that it went superbly.